Hello guys, this is Lil Tools. Today I'm going to show you what the silver pen is. So the silver pen is of course, this is not metal silver, nor this is not a gold. This is just a brass tube and the tip and a silver ink is uh, inside. Um, and the ink itself is not a silver, it's just a silver color. Yeah. So uh, there are a dedicated pen um, for it to be inserted. This refill. I know this looks to be a in refill of some sort of a pen, but uh, it's difficult to get. Um, there are exist, but um, it, the pen itself is not really common. And a lot of atelier and workshop they they use it like like so like like this as just a as a pen like this. And it is a small pen, but it's really not bad grip either. So uh, certain tight points, even it's better to use without any refill and uh, it doesn't have to be this brand or this mark um, you can find every silver pen out there that can be used on leather crafts so uh, well, I'll try to uh, put the link in the description or comment box where you can purchase this type of pen yeah. so this specific brand is Schneider yeah, Schneider brand is uh, famous in Germany they make a lot of pen and pencils and this, this refill tends to be very effective on um, writing um, planning your pattern on your chrome leather. So what you normally do is uh, this is special tan leather and this uh, this is a scratch all this is from Blanchard and you can lay out your pattern like this let's say this is just a pattern okay and if you want to produce um, this this piece multiple on your leather you need to lay out your leather like this right so you need to draw it first so that you can you know um, how many pieces you can get and how many uh, how, how you can lay out your um, pattern so that you can cut off um, these pieces from your leather so uh, you can scratch your vegetable tan leather and it's very obvious that you can see yourself that your pattern is there okay Okay, so you can see yourself, um, your pattern is scratched on your leather, okay? So, so you can see yourself, your pattern is scratched onto your leather, so you can cut out like this. But uh, the problem with, um, yeah. but the problem with this um, chromium tan leather is that it doesn't get scratched easily, yeah? It's, uh, it's difficult to to write any drawings because uh, they are scratch resistant so it's difficult to lay out your pattern okay so what you do normally with your uh, chromium tan leather you don't scratch it with your uh, oil you you have to draw it so this is my pattern and you draw your pattern so so you can lay out your pattern you can you can draw it like this. Yeah, it's very obvious and it's really bright. And you know how you want to lay out your leather on your chrome leather. This is this is very simple, but it's very effective tool. So uh, if you had a very hard time knowing where, you, where your mark is on your on your leather, or if you really don't want don't know how to really place your pattern on your chrome leather before you cut them all. This is just such a um, great way to really um, lay out your pattern using silver pen. Obviously this works uh, really well. Also I know the other brand that works really well. Uh, whatever that is, I'll put the uh, in the description box or in the comment box. So this is it. So this is how you do it. It's a silver pen. So oh, let me try on this leather also. So let's keep trying on this leather only. So. So, yeah, like this. Yeah, so both of them really shows pop in your chromium tan leather, especially dark leathers, and also some bright leathers. Maybe it works on the bright leather 
as well. So let's try on this pink uh, gold skin. So you can you can lay out your pattern. Or well, maybe I should do it on this side. Yeah, so. can see it and this removes with uh, alcohol um, or water alcohol works best you can you can remove the the uh, ink very easily also as well so it's a uh, quite quite good uh, let me try to remove this in real in person on the camera yeah it removes very well With the alcohol. Mm -hmm. So if you want to remove it later, you can remove it. Yeah. So that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. And I will see you guys next video. Bye-bye.